Hey everyone, how are we doing today? Lori from Art Lore, thanks for joining me today. Got my pillow down, which is the PPG Multi Pro Inter Eggshell. And on this 20 by 20 gallery wrap, we're doing, we're starting with purple gray. That is by Liquitex. We're going to do one nice bloom on this 20 by 20. Next up is Liquitex Brilliant Purple. Love the two of these together. Oh my goodness, so pretty. And then of course we have to have some gold. This is Golden's Iridescent Gold Fine. It's lighter than the bright gold fine and I thought it would be a much softer appearance. And then of course we have to have a little blue. Thought that would be a fun accent color. This is Artist Loft Light Blue. And I think that will pair real well with the two purples. And then even though this is completely out of the ballpark here, I thought bright aqua would be kind of fun just to throw in there so that we can see it here and there. And I think it'll be really pretty. My cell activator is going to be the black. Oxide Black by Amsterdam. Just drizzling a little bit more here and there just to ensure some fun little cells. And here we are with our cell activator. And I do three to one with the Aussie Floetrol and the Amsterdam Oxide Black. Okay, here we go. High fan, cool air. Okay, so I think I probably will encourage this. Cells are really pretty. The um, aqua green uh, has like a little bit of the bright purple in the center and then there's gold around it. So that's fun. So let's give this a second or two and see what it does. And then if I have to prod it along, I will. And then we'll be right back. Okay. Solved up quite nicely. Uh, I did have to encourage it a little bit. And I also, um, oh, I just noticed that. I also um, took one of the petals, and I don't remember which one, but I took one of the petals and I um, took off, hold on. I took off, one of the um, tips because it was really wonky. Okay, so we buried that in there, we got rid of that. Now I just want to smooth this out. Because I don't like those little points. All right, let's give it a spin a -rooney. I may have to add more paint. I didn't add paint. I dragged some of the paint to the edge and um, it might not, there might not be enough on there. So I may have to just add more here and there, but I'll, um, I'll do it off camera and then come back because that just takes up too much time. So let's see what we have here. 
It's pretty. Very pretty. Paint is coming off, but I see a little vacant area there in the corner. Oh yeah, this is really pretty. That's got to be filled in. So let me fill that in and then I'll be right back because I don't want to bore you with that. Okay, so I um, was going to put it on a different spinner and the paint is, a, the canvas is a 20 by 20. I don't have a board for it and it's reached its capacity on this 20 by 22 by 22 inch um, spinner and um, I, I can't pull it toward me because I wanted a little bit more of this to come off. So what I did was I just tipped it and kind of eh, kind of brought the paint in this direction and hopefully um, it is, it's coming my way now. So I just want it just a little bit more. Yes, that's exactly what I'm looking for right there. Um, still want that over just a scant, but you know, it's not, bad. Um, do I stop? Do I continue? You know what? I'm going to do this first before I decide whether I'm going to spin one more time. Let's just see what we have. Oh, we have great uh, thickness there, which is half of the tip of the skewer. Yeah, it's wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. So, um, I think it's really pretty, but um, I think I do want to spin it one more time. Do I? No. I think I'm going to stop. I don't like that right there, though. So maybe we'll just do a little tiny spin and maybe that will come off. I think it just did. Where'd it go? Well, if I can't find it, that means it came off. And actually this did come over a little bit more. That negative space is not nearly as wide as it was. So that was a good thing, but oh my goodness, isn't that pretty? Really pretty. So I've got a few little naked spots here and there that I need to fill with my white, uh, but I'm not going to do that on camera. I will do that off camera. So let's take it down and show you the results real quick. And there it is. Gorgeous. That's all I got to say. It is so pretty. And the cells. Oh my goodness. Let's get you in focus. There we are. Aren't they pretty? See how the gold incorporated itself with all the other colors? And look at those cells right there. Aren't they pretty? So there it is. Love it. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Until next time. Bye.